no homo, but I wasn't gon' lose. Cause I wasn't gon' suck dick for no views. You see me if you see me, it's nothing, fuck it. I had to get a hold of myself. Hey, what's up guys, and we are back with some more Madden 18 Ultimate Team gameplay, and today we will be testing out 91 overall Harrison Smith. So just to go ahead and show you guys, man, he is 6'2", 84 speed with 88 acceleration, he has 91 play recognition with 83 tackling, 80 man coverage, and 89 zone coverage, 88 pursuit with 89 hit power now these stats do look good but I like Earl Thomas better still because one he's faster right and speed does matter in Madden 18 two he has the threshold he meets the threshold man the 90 zone coverage and he will play zones he would play routes better than you know somebody with 89 even though it's just one it's just one stat off, you know, um, it really does matter, man. Um, I feel like Earl Thomas is still the better safety because he meets the threshold. He will play routes in the air better. But just for your guys' entertainment, man, we will be testing out this Harrison Smith in this video. So you guys see the rest of the defense, man. Nobody has changed. Nobody has changed on the defense. Nobody has changed on the offense, neither. I'm still trying to get this Jerome Bettis for you guys, man. And, like, I want him on my team, period. Like, I, I want him to be the starter for my squad, man. The dude's stats just look absolutely crazy. We're still trying to get him, though. Um, same thing with Brian Erlacher. We're still trying to get Brian Erlacher, man. But it's just tough right now with everybody just, just jacking the prices on everybody. Like, it's, it's ridiculous. Like, you really can't buy the top players in this game right now because they're all like they all sell for a certain amount and but when you go on the auction block to check for them they're all going for like 500k more than they usually sell for and it's, it's, it's tough to buy any top um, cards in the game right now so with that being said man let's go ahead and jump right into this game all right man let's go all right come on you already know what we got to do and it looks like he's in a cup of four. I, I I can't I can't stand the instant sheds, bro. Come on, man. That's not his user. There you go. Throw that dot. And that's Tony G picking up the first down. That easy. All right, let's go. First and ten. <laughs> like, dude, that's a cover. Yo, he's in a cover. He's, a, he's in a deep blue, bro. Like, how is he playing that corner route? Come on, EA. Get it together. Go run the ball right here. There you go. <laughs> I guess Chris Carter missed this block, man. That cornerback came straight for me. Jeez. There you go. There you go, and that's a touchdown, baby. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about, man. That's a dot. All right, so what I noticed about this guy's defense, guys, is the way he's setting it up. He's running a cover three shell, but he makes his adjustments and, and makes it a cover two, but he still keeps the looping blitz. Bruh. My bad. I, every time, like, a, he calls hike, I try and focus up, man. Good play call by him, but um, he's he's coming out in a cover three blitz, right? But actually, what he's doing is he's switching it. And he's adjusting his cornerbacks and his defensive backs to make it a cover two defense, and that's why we were able to hit him over the middle like that. Even though it says that he was in a cover three, but he really wasn't in a cover three. So yeah. <laughs> Damn! He picked up the first down. I probably should have hit sticked him up top. Maybe he wouldn't have fell forward because I chopped him, so he rolled over. Nope, that's double coverage. Hey. He dropped it. Okay. Let's go! Good heat! Deion Sanders, he did not block his running back to pick up that blitz. And Deion Sanders made him pay for it on that one. Let's go. Give me that. What? 
Hey, all good. As long as he dropped it, right? He gets another chance if he wants to go for it right here, but... Yeah, no! Ah! Good pick, AJ! Oh, Ladanian. Hurt him! <laughs> God damn it, man! Hey, we tried to hurdle him. It did not work out, but we got the interception, man. So let's just keep grinding. And we're already up by seven. All right, let's go, man. We're running the toss right here. Somehow I couldn't cut up field. I tried to cut up, but I ran right into my offensive line. All right, we got to block our running back. He's running. He's trying to run the same blitz, man. This is like he's sending the same blitz that a lot of people run out of the 335 um, odd. The nickel 335 odd. He's running that same blitz, man. And it's this. Why am I running to the... Okay, bro. <laughs> my, my, my receiver's looking straight, right? Well, I mean, obviously he's looking back, but his body is facing straight to run, right? And I rat catch, and he catches it and runs straight to the left to run out of bounds. So I didn't even... One, I didn't get to rat catch it and continue to run for yards. I didn't even get my feet in to make that a completed pass, which I would have ended up kicking the field goal regardless. I would have ended up kicking the field goal regardless because um, I wouldn't have went for it right there. Where are you going, baby? Come on, man. <laughs> Bro, he just ran over Charles Ailey with LT. I hit stick, yo, dude. Let's see if they get a hit stick, man. I'm clicking off next time. Woo! No. Yes! No. No ball hog, baby. You gotta press it, man. No bad timing. You gotta press it right when you know the ball's coming, baby. That's exactly what we did. We got the pick. There you go. That is a dot, baby. Let's go. Come on. Hey, take off, baby. Take off, baby. Let's go. The pocket presence right there, though. He did not blitz all his linebackers this time. That was a terrible read because I suck. <laughs> hey, good pass, man. But I... We're, we're, we're sticking to our what we used to run, man. Bend but don't break defense. So you picking up this little bit, especially when you're down, it doesn't mean a thing to me. There you go. Keep dumping it down, baby. That's the only way you're going to move. This game has a lot of bugs. Nice pass. I don't know why it got open because, like, you're throwing in my yellow zone is right here, but, you know, that's EA for you, man. You just threw into triple coverage. Okay. There. That, that, that's what you should be doing, Demarcus Ware. Bro, good shit, dude. That's what should have happened before. But as, as, as long as it happens, you know, as long as it happens, you got the pick that we deserve. My boy just got a pick six. Let's go. I respect it, man. It's just not something that I would do. You're down three possessions. I mean, you knock it down to two with that field goal, but let's go. Did he just dive in? Dude, I... Why is the cornerback on the opposite side of the field about to track me down, especially if he's running a cover two defense, man? Let's go. Oh my Fuck. god. They get a little bit of success in something, and they think they could just sit in it all game long and it's gonna work for them. As it works for him right there. <laughs> 
Got him! Got him! Man, the same things that I gift you is the same things that I can take away. <laughs> oh my God! Get wiggly on him, Demarcus Ware! Let's go, man! Two pick sixes with D Ware, though? Hey, man. Sometimes you just gotta admit that your scheme isn't as good against a certain defense. Or not saying that it's not good against a certain defense, but Well that too, but you gotta understand, like there's something like I'm baiting you into things, man. You know what I mean? Like I might you might get away with a little bit here and there, but as you go on, bro, the adjustments start to kick in like we were just doing, like we were doing the whole game. And we take away what you're looking for because you thought, hey, this is going to be open because it's been open all game long or it's been open all drive long. And then we take that away. And most Madden players, when you take away that first read that they were looking for, I mean, it happens to me sometimes too. When, when I have something and I think it's going to get open and that read isn't open because you took it away, like I break down after that. I'm like, oh, I don't know where to go. You know, and I take a sack or I fumble or I throw into coverage. I'll still throw it because I'm staring them down and I throw a pick. It happens to a lot of Madden players, man. Bend but don't break, man. That's the best way to play Madden 18. And, I mean, you just gotta be fire on offense, though, because, like, bend but don't break defense is cool, and, like, for the most part, like, you'll get turnovers every now and then, but, you know, if you're playing against a good player, they're gonna be getting field goals, field goals, field goals, and maybe with them, they'll even get touchdowns sometimes, too, but you gotta be consistent on offense with that kind of defensive mentality, and you gotta make sure to, you know, get your touchdowns or get your field goals. You gotta continue to always put points on the board, because... That defense, man, you're, you're probably going to give up points. So you just got to be successful on offense as well. Guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this video, man. I do not recommend the um, Harrison Smith solely because he does not meet the threshold for the zone coverages. Like, you guys see that, you know, when I have Earl Thomas on the field, he balls out. I mean, he plays those routes inside, even if it's in a cover two. Like, he, he he's all over the field, man. Um, you guys see how the defense plays, man. Like, like AJ um, Bouye, um, you see how Chris Harris plays. You see how Rodney Harrison plays. That's because they all have 90-plus zone coverage. They meet that threshold, man. So they play, they play routes so much better, man. And it's just it's something that you guys need on defense, especially right now in Madden. Um, make sure to get... I know these players are expensive. Trust me. Chris Harris goes for like a, um, a million coins, man. AJ Bouye, like, I don't think he's like never on the auction block and if he is like he's overpriced um but they are worth it especially rodney harrison rodney harrison like it, it took me a while to get rodney harrison i had to overpay a little bit for rodney harrison i just did it i just wanted to get it over with um but they are worth it trust me guys when you guys got a, a player that's over 90 zone they are worth it don't even think twice about it, man. I haven't tested that Richard Sherman, but he has 90 plus zone. I think if you um, boost him up, I think. I'm not sure. Um, but I know you guys see that speed and you're like, oh, he has like 83, 84 speed. Like, tr he's a goon, man. Same thing with AJ um, Bouye, man. He has like 84 zone or something like that or 85 zone. That's why I went oh, I went with him over Sherman, but they both play very well, man. I've, I've heard like just so much good things about Richard Sherman. He doesn't even get beat over the top, you know, stuff like that, man. Um, but do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If y'all did, make sure to let me know by hitting that like button. Thank you guys for the support. It really does mean a lot. I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm out of here.